Hey, I'm Jonathan Legg. Anytime I step out for the day, whether I'm in a foreign city or here in Los Angeles or going into the forest, I always bring a day pack. And I think there are some essential things you should always have in your pack. So here it is. That's my day pack that I've had for the last three years. I'm not sure if this is the best brand, but I like it because it's been cheap, durable, and reliable. It has two pockets for water bottles, something I always carry two water bottles so I don't have to buy any single use plastic. And uh, here's a tip if you have a water bottle, put a carabiner on it because a bottle without a carabiner is a bottle you're gonna soon lose. In the main pocket, I carry a puffy jacket. No matter how warm it is, I always have a puffy jacket in my bag. You might get in a train or a bus that's freezing cold. The weather could change, it could get dark on you. Always pack something warmer than you anticipate. Phone charger, an emergency blanket. I have one of these in all my bags. One day, if you're on the trail and you're the last person there, break your leg or your friend breaks their leg this will make the difference between a miserable night and a not so miserable night a little micro towel lightweight super clutch a headlamp in the forest you can stay out past dark it's fun to hike back in the dark with a headlamp in an urban environment you find a, a tunnel or an abandoned building you want to explore or even if you're just walking back to your hotel and you have to walk along a street you you hitch this to your pants and it just swings around and the light bounces all around makes you a lot more visible to cars coming down the road a lot safer a lighter which is good in a survival situation to make a fire to warm yourself and let people know where you are a knife some cities I wouldn't carry this in but always in the wilderness again great in a survival situation if you happen to run into that cougar It'll significantly improve your odds in that fight. Snacks. At the apex of the hype, the person who pulls out the snacks is a champion. Uh, blueberry there. Peanut butter and jelly. I really like this brand. Uh, I know the co-founders, they're solid guys. They give a free meal to someone in Haiti for every box sold. It's got no sugar added, no artificial colors, ingredients. It's just good stuff and like almost 400 calories. It's like a small meal. This uh, Sands bar is, is the winner of all the bars. And uh, that's it. Is there anything I forgot? Is there anything you would put in your bag that I don't have in mind? Let me know. Thanks, I'm Jonathan Lake.